Hello my treasure, welcome back to another figure unboxing video and in today's video we have something Oh my gosh It's so spicy <laughs> Well you already saw it in the thumbnail right? We have the second male bunny figure Ta -da, ta -da, from 10 count it's finally here yes after months and months of waiting and being postponed every time it is finally here in my possession we have here the kurose riku 1 8 figure scale and oh my gosh you know his boyfriend was waiting there in the back thinking like is he ever gonna be here but yep he is finally here and we're gonna get him immediately out of the box because <gasps> look at this is the art that the figure is based off of and oh my gosh it's so cute I love that whip that whip is awesome look at it look at how pretty the figure will look oh my gosh okay dude we're gonna wait a minute look here he has one of the things that I already noticed in the art design is this is more of a soft smile but when you look at the figure picture it's more of an evil smile so is mine gonna have an evil smile or is mine gonna have a soft grin um i'm very curious to find out because uh it's a it's a bit it's a bit of a different grin than the uh than the artwork mm, interesting so i and i also hope that the the his his um shoes aren't damaged just like with of course his boyfriend because i will be very sad so the inside very very pretty it's a green a mint a green a polka dots and my oh gosh these boxes are so beautiful oh look at him oh my gosh oh okay let's see let's see uh i hate blister packages i'm so scared that i'm gonna gonna break it okay there we go come on come on my bunny come to me <laughs> i'm not gonna say it <gasps> oh my goodness oh my goodness let's get everything away from you let's get that out of your legs okay let's have let me have a look at his shoes okay so there are no scuff marks on his shoe let me have a look at everything oh my god look at those gloves <gasps> those gloves are amazing oh my god look at the bunny <laughs> look at the little bunny tail um i think let, let me his face is more evil and annoyed than it is um this one than it is the uh the the soft a uh, grin have a look see he has a more evil uh and an annoyed kind of look here but oh my gosh <gasps> oh my gosh they even you know like sculpted look <laughs> can i show that i should be able to show that right yeah i should be able it's, it's okay it's a male <laughs> if it was a female i could not show it um which is ridiculous but anyway i do think that it will break if you <laughs> took on it too much <gasps> wow look at also his arms and his rolled up sleeve that is really nice it has a metallic shine to it on both sides wow the buttons are also very awesome i love it um i do think is he is he a bit darker skin tone than the other one i do think so he has a very small belly button by the way look here <laughs> that's a very tiny belly button that you have sir okay and now then let's get him on the base so there is i have absolutely no clue how i need to do this it be like this i think it should be like this okay so he has a generic a black base which it's okay right i would have you know liked a bit more things on the base uh but it's okay i'm i'm used to generic black you know bases it's it it is what it is but oh my gosh so his ears aren't it, it's a matte gloss but his ears are so cute i love the floppy ears by the way of his boyfriend a bit more um but i love his pose right the you obey me it feels like an obey me figure right <laughs> you obey me oh my gosh this bunny figure will look so nice next to his boyfriend and oh my god 
I like how his shirt, you know, how the opening of his shirt is. It's it's very well well done. So that you know, like there's a bit of looseness here, so that you can still see his 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 end. <laughs> I'm not gonna say the word, okay? I I I do wanna you know like share this video also with people um, who are, who are a bit more prudish. Um, I am not a prude, okay? <laughs> I don't I don't do prude anymore. I just, you know I, I'm done with that. I've been done with that ever since I turned an adult. Um, so I never had it because I didn't have anything with uh, being prudish when I was a child. Also, um, oh my god. I love also the gloss on his bow. It's really nice. The whole glossy atmosphere. His pants is a matte gloss, which is also very nice. And the thing is, right, it really contrasts then his, his shoes, which are, you know, like in your face, shiny gloss. Here we are. Okay. Is it worth the amount of money I paid for it? Yeah, it is. It is. It's a male bunny figure, okay? Just so you know, it's a male bunny figure. There aren't that many male bunny figures out there. Does it, by the way, because this is a re-release, does it warrant, by the way, the, you know, like after sale prices that they were going for before they were re-released? No, 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 no. It is a very pretty figure. Don't get me wrong. I'm very happy with it. Uh, but I would have not paid the after sale prices for these figures because you know there is not a lot happening right of course i love i love this but the fact that the base is just a generic black base um and there's nothing happening there you know considering what i paid for it i paid this amount for it yeah you know something could have happened you know something should have happened on the base even you know if it's tiny uh, but I know it's a re-release, right? So this is this is this is just how it comes. I almost broke the figure. See, this is why I don't buy scale figures because I am not careful when it comes to stuff. There's not a lot else I can say about this figure other than you know, if you also pre-ordered it, what did you think of it? Do you think it's worth the uh, price that it was sold at? Do you even think it's worth the price of the aftermarket? Uh, let me know. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. And as always, I say, miss you, love you, bye-bye.